Welcome back to our ChatGPT channel, where we explore how to use artificial intelligence to improve our productivity in both professional and personal life. In this video, we use ChatGPT's powerful language capabilities to help us automate our Excel workflow using VBA scripting for automating some of our routine jobs. As we showed you earlier, we analyzed the data with Pivot Table and ChatGPT has defined what to do and how to do that. On this occasion, we are asking ChatGPT to solve the same problem with VB scripting. We need to prompt ChatGPT as so, please provide me a solution to following questions with VBA what was the total revenue for the last year? Which product had the highest sales in the last quarter? Increase marketing spend on which product to increase sales? At first, ChatGPT helped us create three separate scripts to answer three key questions about our sales data. What was the total revenue for the last year? Which product had the highest sales in the last quarter? And increase marketing spend on which product to increase sales? As we want all these to be combined in one, we are prompting ChatGPT to do that easily with the help of a prompt. Can you combine those three script in one? ChatGPT combined the three scripts into one based on our request, and we were able to solve our problem with automating our Excel workflow using the power of VBA scripting. I don't know how to write macros in Excel. So, I don't know how to apply this code. I am asking ChatGPT to show me the way. It beautifully explains me to press Alt and F11 together to call Visual Basic Editor. I did that, copied the code and pasted into there. We did run into a small issue at first, however. ChatGPT initially assumed that our table had a marketing expenditure column and generated the code according to that fact. Unfortunately, the code returned with an error since there was no such column in our table. If this happens, we need to mention this to ChatGPT. It will understand the problem and fix it. I did that by prompting there is no marketing spend column in the table you have provided above. So, the code you provided returns with error. But ChatGPT was able to quickly fix the code for us, using the correct column references for sales and revenue data. And in the end, the code worked perfectly. We need to inform ChatGPT about which column is what perfectly. Otherwise, the code is generated based on assumptions. If this is the case, you can fix it with a prompt such as sales data is in column D and revenue data is in column E so, update the code according to that. Instead of doing that, we could follow ChatGPT prompting rule in the very beginning and give as much details as possible initially. Prompting like that would return more precise solution at the very first time. Here is an example. So, please provide me a solution to following questions with VBA what was the total revenue for the last year? Which product had the highest sales in the last quarter? Increase marketing spend on which product to increase sales? I want all these combined in one script. Products are listed in the column A categories are in column B quarters are listed in column C, sales are in column D and revenues are in column E. The script you are going to provide should also compare all these data, make the necessary calculations and find out to which product marketing investment is to be increased. If we did that in the beginning, ChatGPT would return the correct response initially. Take this as an experience we gained all together with the help of this application. I am trying my videos to be as much natural as it is possible. I believe this approach will help all of us to improve ourselves to have more control on such artificial intelligent application prompting. So there you have it. Using ChatGPT and Excel together can help you streamline your data analysis and automate your workflow, saving you time and effort. We hope you found this video informative and helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more great content on ChatGPT and its many applications, including programming, project management, and more.